Thank you, Joe. Wet conditions in Iowa last week continued to limit farmers' field work. This week, USDA's crop report shows the rain across eastern Iowa has improved soil moisture levels, but it's also keeping farmers out of the fields. Statewide, there was an average of less than a third of a day that was suitable for field work last week. Iowa Secretary of Agriculture Bill Northey says farmers are starting to get anxious about getting out into the fields. KCRG TV 9's Mark Carlson is in our Iowa City newsroom. And Mark, this is a far different picture than what we saw one year ago, and it's having a real effect on more than just farmers. Yeah, Beth, what a difference a year makes. We had a chance to talk to producers all across Johnson County today. Today, what we found was that Iowa is a state full of fields of concern, excitement, and optimism. It's a sight Iowans will be seeing plenty of in the coming weeks, tractors blazing across the countryside. Everybody's got their tractors are hooked up and they're ready to go. It's just waiting for the ground to be ready. Tom Wall normally likes to have his corn and soybeans in the ground by now. We need some warmer weather. We need some, uh, some timely rains later on. For now, his seeds remain bagged. If he doesn't get them in the ground soon, it could have an effect on his yield. Okay. On the other side of Johnson County, dog breeder and farmer Marvin Hotz is starting to see some growth in his garden and fields. Last year I planted, started planting sweet corn there last on the 25th of March. This year it's about the 5th of April and uh, it still's not up yet. A late season appears imminent right as farmers markets begin to reappear in communities across Iowa. When they've been coming in to pay their registration fees, they are telling me that they're planting later this year. Um, some farmers have said I haven't even been able to get into the field. It's all just part of the unpredictable Iowa weather that had last growing season in full swing much earlier than normal, so early that fall apple picking was in full swing by the summer. We had a very low crop last year and not a great one the year before, so what we're looking at right now is sort of record crop. And that's great news, or is it? Now we're worried about next year already, you know, because we don't want them to bear so much fruit this year that they won't give us crop next year. We always got something to worry about. As for the farmers markets, every spot is booked here for the Iowa City Farmers Market, which starts in downtown next Wednesday. There certainly will be some fresh produce, we're told, because a lot of farmers are using those greenhouses. We're live tonight in Iowa City. Mark Carlson, KCRG TV9.